please like and subscribe for our channel growth. Who is Christopher Steele? What to know about the ex-spy and the Trump dossier? Nearly a decade after retiring from Britain's secret intelligence service, Christopher Steele stepped into the world of politics and what an entrance he made. The ex-spy, who spent two decades working as an agent in various countries overseas, is now best known in the US for compiling a dossier on President Trump. Here's what you need to know about Steele, the infamous Trump dossier and a recently released GOP memo that mentions Steele several times by name. Christopher Steele served as an intelligence officer with MI6, Britain's equivalent to the CIA, for more than two decades. He joined as soon as he graduated from the University of Cambridge in 1986. He had a variety of roles within M16. He worked as a field agent and the head of M16's Russia desk in Moscow in the early 90s, spent four years in Paris and transitioned to advisor to the British Special Forces on Capture or Kill Ops in Afghanistan, Variety reported. After his retirement from M16 in 2009, Steele moved to Farnham, England, and CEO founded Orbis Business Intelligence, a London-based corporate intelligence consultancy, with other retired colleagues. According to a profile of Steele in The New Yorker, the company grossed approximately $20 million in its first nine years. The team, draws on extensive experience at boardroom level in government, multilateral diplomacy and international business to develop bespoke solutions for clients, according to a description on the company's website. He has not been back to Russia or any other Soviet states since his retirement, The New Yorker reports. Steele may have had an extensive career, but these days, the former spy is best known for compiling a dossier on Trump for private Washington research firm, Fusion GPS. What is his connection to Fusion GPS? Fusion GPS was hired in 2015 by an anti-Trump Republican donor to research then-presidential hopeful Donald Trump. But as Trump continued to climb the political ladder, winning the Republican nomination, the donor told the firm to drop the project, according to a report from the New York Times. A year later, in the spring of 2016, Fusion GPS convinced Democrats to invest in the project. Fox News learned in the fall of 2017 that the Clinton campaign and Democratic National Committee DNC, paid for Steele's research through the law firm Perkins Coy. Fusion and